How many people have asked you about Peppa Pig? Nobody. Come on, let's start there. <laughs> Johnny, then. Come on, that was so funny. I mean, did you do it deliberately to get in his head? Pepe? Yeah. I did. To be honest, I didn't say him one word to him to get him angry. It was all with the physically that, uh, that I provoke him, but nothing with the mount. And uh, it was only, yeah, too hard to, with him and, uh, yeah, with the hands, but nothing with the mount. So um, I think everybody think I speak or say something to him. Uh, but no, it was not like this. Because it was funny before the game, because as always, Johnny, you know, you're there, you saw the camera and it was Peppa Pig. And so we just wondered if you'd said it during the game, you know, so, but no. Huh? No, no, no. So you just did him with them. Um, do you think he just couldn't handle the fact that you were so intense, Johnny, and that, you know, your physically leads were so, so strong? Is that what it was, really? This was really like this, yeah. It was, it, I think, uh, was difficult to him or was annoying that we was always man to man and uh, yeah and aggressive and really I touched him always sometimes like here and uh, I think two three times and on the end was for him too much and uh, yeah he turned and he touched me also it's not that he didn't touch me of course maybe it was too much what uh, but I think every player do, will do the same thing and he was really, even Louis Cooper was near and the close and he see also, it was really, he touched me. It was, it's not that he broke my nose, but he touched me. And um, the bad thing what I can do is to to give him something back, but I don't want it. Uh, and uh, it's also stupid from him to doing this, yeah. this kind of thing. And I think every player go down. I think it was it was clear, Johnny. It was a red card, we, we thought so at the time. I think the interesting thing though is, Johnny, do you think, other teams are struggling to cope with your physical play as a team. I mean, we all, we all knew this would happen, that you would be like this again, but do you think you've surprised a lot of teams? We work hard in the training, so sometimes we are mounting because hard, but then you realize in the game, this hard work is, so you have success in the, in the game. So, in the game, you heard some players from the other teams like Everton, Arsenal, they're tired or saying, hey, keep this man or he's telling, yeah, but I don't know where he's moving. He's always here, here. And this is not, sometimes it gives motivation. Then you, you know, if I am tired, the other is more tired than me. So I have more power and you see this. And uh, that's why w that we believe on us. If we play like a team and we, with the power that we have for 90 minutes, so even if it's zero zero, like in Everton was the power that we have, we we have more chances to get a goal because we are physically stronger than I think every every team in the Premier League. And, and Johnny, you're in the team at the moment. How do you feel you are playing? Um, I'm enjoying um, the football that we play uh, and the football that uh, we play in the Premier League, the attacking football and uh, up and down, and is. This is what I love, and um, I, it works like a group, really good. So uh, I'm doing also well with them together, and we are the team. Uh, we are, I say it like also in the other interviews, other teams are maybe individually better, but as, uh, we start like a team. We are the team that makes us so dangerous, so strong, and. This is that's why we are all so good, and every player can can uh, performs good. That we play like a team really well, and uh, yeah, everybody f fighting for each other. Johnny, it was great seeing you in the international break. Can you describe just how important and how much pleasure that has given you to get North Macedonia through to the finals? So oh, man, it was. It was I was uh, crying. Uh, at this moment because I know the life how is in Macedonia. Uh, I know how the people lives there. Um, it's not easy for the people and for players that play football there. Of course, I grew up in Switzerland, but I have family in Macedonia and uh, I know for the people there how they live is really a hard life. Um, yeah, no money. Uh, it's a lot of, yeah, hard works that is not 
no, uh, no money in, in the country and uh, yeah and to get success to work hard and to believe also there we with the team we had we are like six seven years together only the same team and the coach he believes on us he knows with the national league that comes now that we play uh, other uh, yeah small smaller uh, countries that we don't have favorite that we can get a chance to to qualify it with with the uh, with the macedonia and we took this serious and we go through to the national league in the euros and uh, it's beautiful for the country of course for each player is nice for the future everything you you get in yours but especially for the country for the people there that uh, yeah to to know a little macedonia and for the football also that we have talents in the country and i'm really really happy for uh, that happened this and um, yeah it shows that uh, we started to to uh, yeah to get bigger it's a great story. It really is, Gianni. What about you, Gianni? I mean, this must be the time of your life. You know, your country's qualified, you're in the Premier League. Hopefully, you'll be longer at Leeds. We'll have to wait and see, you know, if you get a new deal, what have you. But is that how you feel at the moment? You're just blessed. This is the best time. I'm enjoying only my life uh, with Leeds and playing in the Premier League. And uh, I'm believing things on the work that I'm doing here. And... Uh, yeah, the other things, if you are serious, discipline and were believing, working, yeah, the good things come. come. And uh, yeah, I had two dreams, going Premier League and with Macedonia in the Euros. And this, I get it. Now I need to think for another goal. But uh, my other goal is, uh, first of all, focus with Leeds United to go game by game and uh, do, don't be afraid against big teams with this team that uh, I love it because this team we are also with this team I long together we get like a family together and uh, that's why we are fighting for each player for uh, for the helping for each other and uh, that's why it's hurt us if you see someone from us uh, needs help and that's why we fight 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 and that's why we are really strong and uh, this makes me really proud to be in this team. How much are you looking forward to seeing spectators, fans at Chelsea on Saturday? <laughs> A lot of fans. <laughs> um, I'm happy for the people that can come inside because a long time no fans and uh, of course it's only 2000 but happy for the people that come in, can come inside for them. It's nice to can take and watch football indoor. Uh, indoor in the stadium yeah yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. and uh, yeah I was more excited to have Leeds fans <laughs> yeah yeah and this could be a little while I know but I suppose Johnny for you because you like you like the crowd and all that you know most players do I know but just having anybody there will be good whether they're Chelsea or not won't it will, will it not be a boost for you anyway uh. Uh, to be honest, I don't care if there are 2,000 or 100 or 200 people. Uh, it's, I'm only happy for the people that can come inside. But it's different if it's 40,000 than 2,000. And uh, that's why, uh, yeah, 40,000 with these crazy fans. Yeah, and I am crazy, crazy fans, and it is good. I need this. But you're also serious as well, Gianni. I know you, you like to be a bit crazy here and there, but you are serious. You're serious about your career and, and, and about your football. Yes, and yes. I think if someone's speaking six, seven languages, you can do jokes. You can be a joker, but uh, something is also behind me. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's an intelligence there, isn't there? And, uh, and there's a desire to succeed. I and think I... you have moments that you need to enjoy because... It's not everything to be serious, serious, serious. And on the end is enjoy it also. You need to enjoy because it's your life. Enjoy it. If, and uh, of course, you have moments that you need to take it serious. But you have also moments that you need only to enjoy these moments, get the fun and uh, with people because too much serious, yeah, don't get a good mood. And uh, for my opinion, and uh, you need to be funny. You need to have the good mood to to enjoy. And then the moment gonna come that you're gonna be serious. But you're gonna have to be serious this weekend. Chelsea are a you know they're doing really well, aren't they? How? Where do you see their main threats? Of course, they're attacking really good, uh, uh, really good. Have really good individual players that 
can do something, we need to be uh, yeah, uh, a little yeah careful about this. But uh, um, they play also fast football. Some yeah, in the attacking counters they are good. But um, like how I said before, individually they are good. I don't know if they are better like a team together, better than us, to to get uh, the performance like uh, we can do it there. That's why we need to to go there only like a team and to don't be afraid to play like how we play against every each team, every each game, uh, big club. And I think we we are everybody excited to play against these teams because before we watch them, they play Champions League, they play always in Premier League and you see them on TV and now you are there. And I think every player thinking, I want to show them that I am also a good player and uh, we can do this only together. And so like this, we can get good uh, good performance. And, and just finally, Gianni, in te- are you able to say anything about your future at the moment? There's a bit of talk that you were looking at a new deal. Has anything happened or is that still for the future? Still nothing happened. Um, I am here till is my contract. Uh, yeah, my contract, of course, end in uh, in next year. But I'm not thinking that I will leave uh, Leeds. It's uh, my my head is only for Leeds concentrated. But uh, what gonna happen happen on the end? But uh, of course, I will love it to stay here. And uh, but these are um, things that. Uh, yeah, other people we gonna manage this, but if I'm, I want to enjoy only the moment that I'm here. I want to be focused for the football and the other things. Of course, I see in the media, but um, this uh, nothing happens still. I'm uh, and yeah, I I'm here uh, every every day serious and uh, focus for uh, enjoying every day in Leeds. And we like to see you enjoy, especially with this pandemic that's been going on, Gianni. It's nice to see someone that's able to bring people a bit of joy in their lives. So don't ever change, will you? Uh, I'm going to be like how, how I am every time. <laughs> Excellent. Gianni, it's been a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you very much, Adam.